Hi, I'm Holly. So welcome to this practice. This practice is a flowing style of yoga and it's all about self hugs today. So really just giving yourself this big, big hug. I think we all need it right now. Lots of loving. So please do start standing. If you want any props, there's blocks that you can use. You can also have a blanket for underneath your knee if you need any extra support. So grab yourself a block or some books, whatever you have around at home. But otherwise we'll start standing. And try to bring yourself now somewhere right in the center point of your balance. So you're not leaning too far forwards, not leaning too far back. And as you grip down through the toes, you feel the inner arches of the feet lift. You feel that upward lift through the fronts of your thighs. The tailbone lengthening down. And if you feel comfortable to let the eyes close, feel this upward lift through the crown of the head towards the sky. And we'll take this moment to really observe our breath. Come into this practice with this full bodied breath and maybe this is the first time today you'll have paid any attention to it so let's take a moment to really feel that inhale rising up through the body and then exhale feel the shoulders unfurl but standing tall and again a full deep breath in and a slow breath out. As you inhale, almost feel like you're filling up your whole body. And as you exhale, feel as though you're deflating all that air from your body, giving you more space to then take a full breath in and a slow breath out. Let's take a few more breaths in the inhale we travel up through the spine and then let's slightly open the mouth but with pursed lips as if you were blowing out a candle exhale feel that cool air and again inhale with slightly pursed lips exhale And as we breathe naturally, we have this amazing tool, our breath to help us ease any anxiety, any stress. Really follow that breath today. So we're gonna take a breath in when you're ready and reach the hands up to the sky. Feel free to look to your fingertips and then we spread the fingertips nice and wide and exhale to slowly lower the hands back to the sides. Let's again take the inhale to reach the hands to the sky, looking up. And then exhale, really broaden into your heart and your chest as the hands come down. Good, we're gonna take a few more like that. The inhale, we reach tall, lift through that front body. And then exhale, nice and wide. One more together, inhale, reach up nice and high. Good, and then exhale, nice and wide. This time as we inhale, we interlace the thumbs, reach up nice and tall. And then gently exhale over, send by, I uh, can't speak, reach over to your right side. So try not to simply sink into that side of your right waist, but reach up through that whole left side. Breathe in. Good, let's breathe out to center. Breathe in, reach tall. And then exhale to the left. Good, again, lift away from the ground, breathe in and breathe out, lovely. We're gonna open the arms wide and then take your arms round to your shoulders. You're gonna take the right elbow under the left. Inhale, reach up, giving your arms a squeeze. And then soften the knees as you exhale, curl into your heart. And again, inhale, reach the elbows high. Exhale. Open the arms like wings as you rise up and tall, breathe in. Good, exhale, lower the hands. Let's take the left elbow beneath the right as you wrap the arms round and inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, soften your knees and curl as you round into your upper back. 
and again inhale dive your arms forwards lift your gaze and then exhale curl as you really roll into your spine nice and slow let's open the arms like wings and then inhale reach to the sky look up Wonderful, and then exhale, we'll fold all the way to the ground, fingertips to the earth or maybe on your blocks. And then just walk out those feet nice and slow. So almost feeling the hips gently sway side to side. We're walking out through your feet. Good, spread through the toes. Notice how that feels in your feet today. Let's take a full breath in and float the heart forwards. Maybe the fingertips come to the shins. And then exhale, fold. Well done. Let the chin roll to the chest. Now you can really have a deep bend into the knees here if you need and allow the head to really unwind. And when you're ready, we're going to inhale again. Lift the heart, the chest. And together, let's step back into our first downward facing dog together. So really send the weight through the fingertips, spread through the toes, but keep a little softness in the knees whilst we're warming up here. And we can play around a little to still keep that rhythm and allow the body to just warm up. So maybe there's a little walk out of the heels. Maybe there's a little twist through the torso. But again, any time you want to rest, you're welcome to come down. Let's take one breath in and exhale. Inhale, roll over your knees, coming to all fours. And then exhale, press your seat to your thigh, your heels into a child's pose. Good, well done everybody. Take a breath here. And a breath out. So if you can listen really carefully to this, because sometimes it can be confusing to hear, to, uh, to kind of do this position without seeing it. So we're going to inhale, come up to all fours. As we come forwards, the right arm is going to sweep back up to the sky. So we do a full 360 movement through that right shoulder. And then the hand comes to the floor. We exhale, press back into a child's pose, forehead to the mat. As we inhale forwards to all fours, we take the left hand back. So sweep the mat, reach up over to, your, to the sky. And then exhale, lightly press back. Yes, well done everyone. Let's take a few more to each side. So on the forward breath, we inhale the right arm to the sky. Exhale, press back. And on the left, inhale. Reaching back to child's pose. Exhale, well done everybody. Take one more to each side in your own time. That right arm reaches forwards. And exhale, lovely guys. I can see those arms, great. Inhale, left hand forwards. And exhale, take a little sway, let the arms roll. Maybe even let your forehead massage on the mat as we really press and massage across the pituitary gland. So we release those feel good hormones today. When you're ready, we inhale forwards to all fours, tuck toes and exhale. We're gonna inhale, come forwards to a plank but then bend the knees, stay strong in the core as you exhale back to downward dog. Two more together, inhale forwards to your plank. Soften the knees, engage the core as you exhale downward dog. One more together, breathe in to plank. Soften the knees and exhale hips to sky, well done. Lower the knees and then slide your right foot forwards. Ground the left hand beneath the left shoulder and we inhale, that right hand sweeps across the front of the body, up over the head as you exhale, reach behind. Let's take two more. So inhale, sweep back and behind, exhale. One more together, everyone. Inhale, exhale. Good option to hold here. Or if you feel warm already, you're welcome to draw the back heel towards your buttocks. Take a hold with your right palm and roll the right shoulder to the sky. Breathe in, maybe you're here, that's fine. Breathe out. And then sweep the palm forwards. Square your feet, square your hips rather to the top end of your mat. And this is where you may want a block nearby, a block or two. 
and we're going to slowly lift the back knee ease your weight forwards and backwards and we really want to control that tracking of the knees in line with the toes when you're ready from here we're going to inhale straighten both legs hug the chin to the chest and then with a full exhalation, bend that front knee, lunge as you press your heart forwards. Good, again, inhale, curl into the spine, chin to chest. And then exhale, press your heart forwards. Let's take one more nice and slow, breathe in. And then exhale, open the mouth as you Good, when you're ready, we're gonna slowly send that right leg back, downward facing dog. Breathe in, breathe out. When you're ready, you can lower the knees, step the left foot forwards, good. Ground the right palm as we inhale, take that full circle through the left arm, exhale. Inhale, reach that left hand to the sky and back. Exhale, good. One more together. Breathe in and breathe out. Option to hold here or maybe the back heel draws to the buttocks. You roll the left shoulder back and breathe in to lift your heart to the sky. Good, everyone. Breathe in. Breathe out. Release the hand. Square the hips to the top. And then again, rock your weight back and forth as we lift the back knee. Maybe you have to just bring your stance a little bit shorter. Maybe you have a block. We're going to inhale, lift those left toes and hug the chin to the chest. And then exhale, send your heart forwards into this long lunge. Yeah, nice. Tim and Ash, I can see that. Great. Inhale, chin to chest. And then exhale, extend your heart forwards. Good, inhale. Really feel the belly button scoop up and in. And then exhale through the mouth as you send your heart forwards. We're gonna lower the palms. When you're ready, slide that left foot back. Find your downward facing dog. Breathe in, roll over the toes to plank. We'll start by exhale, lowering the knees and lower nice and slow and control to the belly. Slide your forearms forward. So if you're pregnant, you can stay in your cat-cow stretch. Toes grounded down and take your time to now inhale, reach your heart up. Shoulders down. And then exhale, roll chin to chest. Let's tuck the toes, press to all fours and together meet in downward facing dog. Good, breathe in. How you all doing there? Breathe out. Knees soft. Keep the hips nice and high, guys. You okay there, Kate? <laughs> breathe in. Breathe out. Let's take a little softness in those knees to encourage your hips to rise up. The head nice and relaxed. Good, let's start to add on everybody. So option to lower the knees if you prefer. We're gonna inhale the right leg to the sky. And then exhale, hug the knee to the navel and step that right foot forwards. Option to lower that knee. And again, the left hand is lowered. We inhale, sweep the right hand up, back and round as we exhale. Inhale, right hand high. Exhale, draw back. Together, last time, breathe in. Breathe out. Lower the right palm. Slide that back foot in an inch or so if you need to. Then inhale, hug the chin to chest. Straighten the legs. Exhale, extend your heart forwards. Good, inhale. We curl in through the spine, pyramid pose. And then exhale, extend that back heel, the shoots away. One more together, breathe in, breathe out. So nice and carefully, we're gonna turn the back heel down. We're gonna swivel our right toes in and we'll be turning now to face the other end of our mat. So you might not see me, 
I'll try and talk as clearly as possible. The left foot is forwards, the back knee is going to lower. And then we rise up to a low crescent lunge as the hands reach to the sky. Breathe in. That's it, everybody. Breathe out. We're going to start by opening the arms nice and wide like wings. And then inhale, take the right arm under the left as we come to hug our shoulders, squeeze at the shoulder blades. Breathe in, lift your heart, lift the elbows to the sky, a little back bend. And then exhale, curl in as you round through the upper back. Open the arms like wings and then inhale, glide the palms up to the sky. Good. Open those arms again wide like wings for one more breath. Breathe in. And then breathe out. Wonderful. Lower the palms. Lift the back knee and together we inhale. Step our right foot forwards. We're at the back end of our mats. Take a breath in. And then exhale. Float your heart to your thighs. Open your arms out like wings. Now engage through the core as we inhale to rise up to the sky. Whoops. And then exhale, hands to your heart. Good. Inhale, let's open the palms wide, reach high. And then exhale, float your heart forwards. Chin comes to chest and your forward fold. Inhale, coming to that halfway lift. So maybe fingertips are on the shins or on the mat. And then exhale, step back, downward facing dog. Breathe in for one. Breathe out. You're going to inhale, roll over the toes to a plank position. Now option here to lower the knees, or maybe you'll lower all the way through a plank to the mat. Ground your pelvis, ground your toes. Now slide the arms forwards. Maybe elbows are down for an easier option. Or maybe the elbows are lifted now into a wide-armed cobra. Good, everybody. Roll the shoulders back. Lift from your core. And then we're going to slowly roll the right cheek to the right shoulder. And then over to the left. Let the eyes close as you slowly work through Drawing a circle from the crown of the head. Try not to go too fast so you don't feel dizzy. And then change direction. Breathe in. Breathe out for one more breath. Breathe in. And breathe out. Let's lower. Take your forehead to the mat. Inhale, press to all fours. And exhale, downward dog. Good, everybody. Option to lower your knees. We're going to inhale the left leg to the sky. And exhale, hug knee to navel as you step the left foot forwards. Option to lower the back knee. Inhale now. It's the left hand that travels up over across the body. And exhale, back and behind. Two more. Breathe in. Put that full circle through that arm. Left. Exhale. Last one together, breathe in, breathe out. Well done, plant the hand down. Maybe you need to slide the back foot in a few inches. We're gonna inhale, lift the left toes, hug the chin to chest. And then exhale with a nice strong exhalation, breathe forwards. Two more, breathe in and breathe out. One more, breathe in. Breathe out. And then carefully lower the back heel. Spiral yourself back to the front of your mat. Hopefully we're all there. Lower the back knee. We inhale, rise up to our low crescent lunge. And then open wide. Great, I can see you all. Hi. Let your arms inhale, reach to the sky. And like wings, expand into the chest. Good. We're going to this time take left elbow under right. Hug your shoulders, squeeze your shoulders as you inhale, rise up through the elbows. And then exhale, hug into the center line, round to give yourself a squeeze. Inhale to rise up. And then open the arms like wings again. Spread through your fingertips, well done. We're going to lower the palms to the floor. We're going to lift the back knee. And then slowly step back, exhale, downward facing dog. 
have a little sway find your breath good as we transition to our next phase so take a nice deep breath in exhale deep breath in exhale well done everybody okay so we're gonna bring the feet together side by side option here is to lower the knees and lower the right knee first if you prefer or we're going to inhale the right leg to the sky so reach through your toes we're going to exhale hug the knee into the navel now scoop and round through your upper back for space and again inhale reach to the sky try not to rush exhale knee to navel stacking those joints let's take one more together breathe in nice everybody exhale knee to navel so maybe that right knee comes down or stack the shoulders cross the right knee across the body and then thread it through over to your left side you've still got your shoulder joints stacked and then shift the weight to that right palm the left inner sole of the foot and reach that left hand to the sky yes everybody if you're wanting to lower the right knee you're very welcome to we're going to take a few shoulder rolls so when you're ready inhale the left hand sweeps forwards up to the sky and exhale one more together breathe in and breathe out lower the palm square your shoulders hug the knee to your chest option now to inhale right leg to the sky or maybe you meet in downward dog more advanced option you can come forwards to plank maybe it's a three-legged plank and then we all lower to the ground with control slide the palms forwards inhale wide-armed cobra and then exhale chin to chest press back downward facing dog well done everybody breathe in breathe out same leg again the inhale the right leg rises to the sky and then exhale hug the knee and squeeze through the upper back as you step that foot forwards option to lower the back knee so now it power up through your core and we inhale rise up to a high lunge good take the hands forwards press the heart forwards as you inhale rise up and exhale open wide let's take our hug again as we roll our elbows wrap around one another good squeeze through the shoulders and breathe in lift up breathe out round and curl inhale nice and strong through your balance exhale and then open the palms wide like wings breathe in breathe out find your breath so gaze forwards power up through the abdominals and lightly tiptoe that back foot forwards as we float our heart forwards and lift up to warrior three we're balancing on that one leg now if you've got a wall nearby you can have a little <laughs> cheat there and hold on but square the hips lift away from the ground and reach your arms out like you're flying now breathe in keep going guys breathe out yes Sarah lovely looking great go Rupert one more breath everyone breathe when you're ready release the back leg rise up warrior one and then float the hands forwards well done everybody exhale downward dog or maybe three-legged down dog if you want to reach that right leg to the sky together we all meet in plank exhale lowering the right foot maybe you're lowering through your plank to the mat float the hands forwards inhale wide arm cobra yes exhale together downward facing dog let the weight of your head guide you back lengthen through the arms breathe the hand breathe out we're going to take the feet together side by side 
Again, option is to lower your knees if you wish. We're going to inhale that left leg to the sky. Exhale, hug knee to navel, really scoop around through your upper back for space. Again, together we inhale, left leg to the sky. And exhale, knee to navel. Inhale, left leg high. And then exhale here, there's an option to lower the left knee. Or we're going to thread that knee across the midline of the body. Keep stacking shoulders over wrists. And thread that left leg through. Well done. Now the weight shifts to the left hand. The right in arch of the foot. The, left, the right heel and then the right hand reaches to the sky. Let's take our shoulder rolls as we inhale right hand forwards. Exhale reach up. Inhale that hand forwards. Yes everybody. Exhale reach up. Well done. Wonderful. Square yourself back to the mat, right hand to the ground. Engage through that core and then together we slowly send that left leg back to the sky. Breathe in. Good. Option now to lower the foot or come forwards to your plank. Option to lower knees or lower through your plank. Inhale, cobra. Yes, exhale, lower. Press back and downward facing dog. Really good, everybody. Inhale that left leg to the sky. You're doing well. We're nearly coming back to that balancing. So exhale, knee to navel, step the left foot forwards. Option to lower the back knee. Find your breath. And then when you're ready, empower your legs up. Inhale, rise up, high lunge. Back leg is lifted if you wish. Open the arms wide. Inhale, rise up. And exhale, open wide. Good, we're gonna hug, take that hug. Left elbow underneath right. Press through the feet, rise up through the elbows as you breathe in. And then curl into the center, round through the upper back. Give yourself a squeeze. Inhale to rise up. Ooh, bit of a wobble. And then exhale, curl in. Open those arms like wings. And then slowly when you're ready, gaze forwards. Find your focal point. Let's tiptoe the back foot forward. Inhale, power up through the left side. And reach those right toes away. Warrior three. Breathe in. Yes, breathe out. Let your heart lengthen forward. Good, draw the shoulders back, lengthen out like wings for one more breath. And together we lower the back foot, inhale, warrior one, reach high. And then exhale, lower the palms to the ground. Option to step down dog or three-legged dog as you lift the left leg to the sky. Lower the foot if you wish or lower through plank or even chaturanga if that's in your practice. So elbows hug your side waist. We inhale, rise up or take our cobra. And then hug the chin to chest. Exhale, downward dog. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. And open the mouth wide as you exhale. Lower the knees to the floor. Press your seat to your heels and allow your forehead to rest to the mat for a moment as you roll on the forehead nice and slow. Notice how it feels. Your breath, powerful breath. Good. When you're ready, we're gonna slowly come forwards to an all fours position. If you prefer to rest there, you're very welcome to. You're going to step your right leg forwards. Good. And then keeping the back leg flat, can you lower your seat back so you're actually sitting on that heel? Now, if this is really uncomfortable for you, please feel free to stay sort of in this lunge position. If you're okay bringing your weight back into that back foot, 
the foot is flat. See if you can now engage through your core, float the hands up and float the right leg off the floor. Breathe for me here. If you're kneeling, that's fine. We're gonna come and meet you there. So shoulders relax, power up through the abdominals and together we're gonna lift up and lift the leg up at the same time. So we're, we're kneeling now, everybody's kneeling. See if you can, whoa, there's gonna be a lot of wobbling. <laughs> Bend that front knee and try and breathe here as we embrace that wobble. Yeah, breathe. Really good effort, everyone. I'm really wobbling here, so don't worry, we're all gonna be doing it. Take a deep breath in and out. And now see if you can slowly extend that right leg forward. Can you lower back down without the foot touching the floor? Whoa! <laughs> well done, yeah, fantastic. And then very slowly come forwards to your low lunge. Take a little sway forwards and back. Really good effort, everyone. Well done, breathe in, breathe out. Let's slowly send that left leg back, stretch it out, reach out through the toes, reach out through the left toes, and then step your left foot forwards. Let's try this on the other side. So which side has got more balance today? So when you're ready, if you're okay to flatten the right foot, see if you can sit yourself back on that back foot. Good, I can just see so many tiny squares. I wish I could see you clearer. So you're gonna start to now engage through the core, lift tall through your spine, and then reach your arms up. Can you slowly extend the left leg away now? Breathe, the foot is just about an inch off the floor. And then if you're in your kneeling pose there, we're gonna meet you now as we slowly inhale, lift off the ground, bend the left knee and come to balance here. I'm gonna take a little sneaky peek at you all, good. Keep looking forwards. Yes, everybody, keep breathing. There's loads of wobbling, that's great. Really good, breathe. Good, one more deep breath. And then see if you can slowly stretch the left leg away. Keep drawing in through those abdominals and can we slowly lower to the ground Ooh, without putting the foot down. Well done, breathe. We're gonna ease forwards to our little lunge and just allow ourselves to just rock back and forth nice and slow. Take the left foot leg behind, stretch it away, give the foot a little wiggle and roll out the ankle. And then the same to the right side. Well done, everybody. When you're ready, take the toes together, the knees apart, press your seat back nice and wide into your child's pose. Breathe in, breathe out. And I'm gonna get you to sway here. Let the forehead rock on the mat. Yeah, lovely. So really feel that pressure across the brow, the forehead. Let's take two more breaths, breathing in. Feeding your breath, breathing out. Feel the inhale where the belly expands onto your thighs. Feel the exhale where your whole back broadens into space. When you're ready, we're gonna slowly press into the hands, hug the abdominals in and roll your spine up like a rag doll. So you're now seated at the back of your mat, hopefully on your heels. Good, now if it's too uncomfortable for you, feel free to come down to sit off your heels. If you're okay here for a moment, sit your seat on your heels. Inhale, reach your hands to the sky. And then exhale, open your palms wide out to the side. We're gonna take right elbow under left, Squeeze your shoulders. Inhale, lift the elbows to the sky. And then exhale, round into the upper back and really give yourself that healing hug. 
Feel the touch of your fingers on your shoulder blades. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Let's slowly inhale. Let the elbows lift. The gaze reaches high. And then we release the hands to reach out through the fingertips. Good. Let's take left elbow under right. Squeeze the shoulder blades. Inhale, rise up. And then exhale the chin to the chest and again take that healing, nurturing hug. Hold yourself. Take that deep breath. Take that slow breath out. Knowing that everything you have is in your body in this moment. Together, one more breath in. And exhale. You're going to inhale the elbows to the sky and then open the arms again wide like wings. Well done, everybody. Roll out your shoulders a couple of times. And then place your hands to the floor. Tuck your toes under. And then walk yourself back so you're kind of propped up on your tiptoes like a squat. Can you reach your hands back? and then slowly extend your legs forwards. Well done, give your legs a good shake out there. You can even tap into the thighs, give the legs a good shake out. Your legs can come now as wide as your mat, uh, wider, sorry. So taking a really wide stance here. If the hamstrings are tight, have a little bit of a bend there in the knees and really press the heels away. Option to bring your hands behind if there's any tightness in the lower back. But if you're okay in your hips and your lower back, take a gentle sway from side to side. Good. We're going to inhale, reach the arms forwards and continue that flow. So that, um, the pregnant lady there, this is a really lovely one for pregnancy. You can really encourage lots of rolls into your hips here. You can hold the back of your mat if need be. For those of you that have your hands reaching forwards, maybe your hands can come to the floor. Maybe you continue that fluid flow from left to right, right to left. And then let's slow that sway down. When you're ready, take a deep breath in. And then exhale, hold here. Keep the heart lengthening forwards. Ground down deeply through the hips. And almost feel as though those inner thigh creases are drawing backwards. Well done. Start to slow the breath down now. Deep breath in. Slow breath out. Deep breath in and a slow breath out. Let the chin hug to the chest. With these forward folds, it's all about patience. So take your time, round through the upper back, engage through your core, and then roll your spines up like a rag doll, bone by bone. Head is last to come up, and then roll out your shoulders, well done, everybody. Let your knees hug towards your chest. Nice and slow. Again, we'll take that healing, nurturing hug. Squeeze your knees in. Appreciate yourself. Take a deep breath in and out. When you're ready, you're going to send the heels away and then slowly walk your hands behind you to lower to the ground. So for the lady who's pregnant there, you're welcome to lie on your side here with a cushion under your head. This is more comfortable for you. For those of you that are lying on your back there, we're gonna hug the right knee to the chest, extend the left leg away, and then just circle out your right ankle. Settle down now, take a deep breath in. And then as you exhale, you're gonna take the leg across the left side, 
roll the knee down. Don't worry if the knee doesn't touch the floor or you can have a block under that knee. Option to just relax the right arm or you can start to reach the right fingertips towards the end of your mat. Sweep the arm up over the head so you get that full circle and then we settle that right shoulder down. Let your gaze turn to the right. And let your right cheek rest towards the ground. Take a deep breath in and out. Oh, well done. Really nice. So yeah, I think you've got it. Your name says beef there. So when you're, if you're comfortable there, just take those few deep breaths lying on your side. For the rest of you that are in your twist there, just allow your, yourself to take one more full deep breath in. Expand through that front body. And then exhale. When you're ready, slowly let the right knee hug back to your chest. Squeeze both knees in, take a gentle hug and a rock on your back to massage out your back. Good, then the left knee stays in, right leg head sent away. Circle out through your left ankle joint. Breathe in. And then exhale, we'll take the knee across the body. Option to rest the left arm or maybe you're gonna sweep the left fingertips to the end of your mat up over across the body, up overhead, and then we plant that left palm down to our twist. Let the gaze turn to the left. Let your cheek rest towards the ground. And close your eyes. Feel that full body breath filling up into the heart, the chest. And then you can open the mouth as you exhale. One more deep breath in. Exhale. Well done. Let your head slowly turn to the center. Gently hug your knees back to the chest. Squeeze your knees in and rock on your back from side to side. Maybe let the knees go a little bit wider to encourage a little massage now at the sacrum, the base of the spine. Take a deep breath in and out. You're going to take the soles of the feet to the floor. Let your legs now stretch away from your body. Let your palms reach up over the head, holding onto your elbows. Take a big deep breath in. And then open the mouth wide as you exhale. Let your palms come away from the body, just resting to your sides now. As we come to lie in our final resting pose, Shavasana. So for beef, if you prefer again to stay on your side, you're welcome to do so. We're gonna take a few moments here in our final relaxation. Now, if you need to be done after 45 minutes, we're done now, but please, if you have the time to just stay for just a few more moments, stay warm, maybe you prefer to sit in meditation, or maybe you're happy to lie there for a moment. So let your eyes close. Feel the weight of your legs are heavy. Good. Feel the weight of your arms are heavy. Feel the weight of your whole back heavy on the mat. Just feeling now that softening across the brow, the forehead. Now the eyes feel heavy as if they sink into the face. 
Take a few moments to settle, allow the breath to slow down. As we close this practice this morning, uh, we'll close now with a short poem. So just take a moment to really allow this to absorb through you. Eyes remain closed. Set fire to all your maps. Forget how it's always been. We're explorers of the heart, learning to dream again. The adventure of a lifetime with love alone as our guide. Exotic places beyond imagination, ones we've longed for deep inside. Take a nice deep breath in. And out. Another deep breath in. And out. And when you're ready, just starting to now listen now to the sound of your breath. As you deepen that breath. Start to listen to all the sounds that surround you. Maybe they're sounds within your room. Maybe they're little noises or little voices. Sounds of anything outside of your room, nature. And then start to become aware and really Awaken your senses to any smells, any touch, any tastes. Good. Well done, everybody. When you're ready, take a nice big inhale as you stretch your arms up over your head. Take a full breath in. As if it's that first stretch of your day. And then exhale, give yourself a big hug, wrap your arms around your body, embrace yourself in that hug, take a deep breath in. Exhale, take a nice big yawn to stretch your jaw and release. Well done, let your knees hug to your chest and ease your way up to a seated position. Well done, everyone. Just take a seat for a moment if you've got time. Good. Just maintaining in that stillness that you've created. So try to lift up tall and elegant through your spine. Notice how you're feeling now, how still you may feel. And let your hands come to prayer at your heart center. And you rub the palms together and build up a bit of heat into your palms. And then place the palms over your eyes, welcoming in that softness for your gaze. Breathe in deeply. And then breathe out slowly. Let your hands lower to your heart. And thanking yourself for making it here today. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Namaste.